welcome to my channel it is christmas eve and i am now about to show you my january setup i hope you're all okay um i'm just going to do a little flick through of my sort of collections book for 2020 um i've got my new films that i'm going to watch or movies if you're in the us this is my 2020 in photos i do one photo a month it worked really, really well that's my time capsule um i'm gonna write 10 things that if I could I'd put them in a time capsule and it could be anything anything you want um that was my gift spread this is my savings spread if I do that I'll have over a grand by the end of the year and then the rest of it is just a monthly for each month and because I've done that I'm not actually going to do a monthly in my planner so there you go 2020 and my word of the year is better I'm hoping for a better year in 2020 because quite frankly 2019 was awful it really really was so let's get down to it this spread and the spread on the opposite page are templates basically um, this one is going to be for my finances and the idea is is that I write down my recurring bills or direct debits or outgoings my recurring outgoings on the date that they should go out um, next to the relevant number and um, that way when I do look through my monthlies or through my weeklies i know that i've then got to put that tracker there and it's just it's just a list i may not refer to it too much because it will i'm going to copy it over each month into the monthlies um but it's just a list for me so that i know what i've got going in and out this spread on the other side is my weekly template and on here i write down all the things that definitely happen each week each week so in the orange is my eldest son's working hours um, he's a volunteer at, uh, for a local charity and um, these are just his hours this blue is my fourth child's wrestling um, uh, training and then I've got some other people's uh, live broadcasts. Uh, my youngest got returned to library book on a Friday. Uh, the brown is my Fitbit type stuff. And then as you can see, they're syncing planners on Sunday. I keep this planner and I keep an A6 in my purse. So let's jump forward to the January cover page. And I decided that I was going to do flowers. My main reason for that is is <laughs> purely because I have a lot of floral washi tape and um, I couldn't, really couldn't think of anything else to do. I didn't, everyone seems to do fireworks in January and I really didn't want to do that. So um, I just sat and sketched some flowers. I've not put any colour on it because the washi tape I have used throughout it I thought was pretty enough. And uh, I was actually quite worried that the colour would ruin it so yeah i just uh added a little bit of shading to make it look pretty and then i moved across to this spread this is my instagram tracker and um, i unashamedly stole this from jashi corin and um basically what it is is i want to post to instagram every day every day so i write a list of things that need to be posted such as a new weekly spread uh, my cover page you know stuff like that and um, then there are three columns the column on the left means that the picture is ready i actually didn't label the columns i've just realized that um the column in the middle means that the picture is taken and then the column on the right means that it's been posted to instagram so i actually need to go back at some point and remember to label those um you see me this is me just checking my notes and i knew i'd gone wrong somewhere and then i realized what i'd actually forgotten i've left myself a couple of blank ones just in case i find something else that needs to be added in and and then that's pretty much it and add a little picture of a camera and there we go this is my square tracker um this is probably my most popular tracker people really really like it and um i'm you know chuffed to bits that they do it's it's a couple of people have copied it and copied it quite successfully um it's a bit of a pain to draw but once you once you figure out the mathematics of it it is actually it's it's just a case of just drawing in all the lines really um i track 11 things 11 different things and this 
month for January, I've gone with Day Face Cream Makeup Challenges. That's uh, challenges I find through Bujo Challenges on Instagram. Um, one can or less. That's one can or less of dark fizzy drinks that contain caffeine, basically. Um, no booze, no chips or fries if you're in the States. Did you craft, as in did you knit, sew, use your spinning wheel, anything like that? Homework, that's Daryl's homework. Meds, weights and night care routine. And then I just added tracker in that space on the left hand page and that was pretty much it. This next card is my card of the day spread. Um, every day I, if I remember, try to pull a tarot card. Um, I'm going to change it this for January. I'm actually going to try and remember to pull the card the night before. So it'll be my card for tomorrow kind of thing rather than the card of the day because I simply don't have time in the mornings to sit down at my planner. And I know that if I made time to sit down at my planner, I would then be at my planner for hours because I just get carried away. So yeah, this next spread, this next, yeah, this next spread is my about me spread. So what I'm doing just done there is my mood and my pain trackers. And um, now I am going to add in my measurement spread. I found this picture on Google and thought it was better than the stencil that I was using, which quite frankly was naff. And I wouldn't recommend the company that I bought it from. And um, yeah, I found her online. And I was like, oh, she, she's hysterical. It wasn't until later I realised she looks a bit boss-eyed, but I did actually correct that after my recording. <laughs> One of her pupils was a lot smaller. And all I will record on here is my weight, um, my clothes sizing, my BMI, and then I will measure around my upper arms, my hips, my stomach, and my upper thigh. And I just liked her. I thought she was funny. So, yeah. Yeah, and then on the right, like I say, I will track my mood and my pain levels. And then I'll just add in a load of pretty floral um, washi, because why not? These next two spreads are quite um, basic <laughs> in comparison to some of them. Um, the On the left, under the pretty butterflies, I track my sleep. Now, on the right half of that spread, it's the hours that my Fitbit tells me I have slept. Yeah, and then on the left of it is how well I think I slept. So if I wake up and I feel refreshed and I feel great, then that's fantastic. Um, the right hand spread is just my steps and my miles as per what my Fitbit says. Now this one is my most popular spread. This is the one that people are always, wow, that is awesome, that's brilliant. I came up with this several months ago because I needed a cleaning tracker. Um, quite simply, I was getting overwhelmed with it all and I needed something that would keep me on on track as it were hence the tracker so the idea is is that i write down chores that have to be done every single day but i've relegated them so some chores are only done on a monday for example um, i clean my television on a monday um, on tuesday my bins have to go out so it's just stuff like that you know and um, that's basically all this is and it's actually quite simple once you realize how it's laid out it's just a question of drawing it. It takes so long. It really does. And then this one in the corner that I'm just doing now is stuff that only needs to be done once a month. And that's basically it. And then I just write in the dates, which I messed up. I got that wrong. I usually get something wrong. And uh, yeah, then I just wrote in all of the days and the chores. Sorry about my head getting in the way. And it's just set up for me to use. And then if I do the chore, it gets coloured in with the pen of the day because I colour code everything. Um, that way I know what has to be done and when it has to be done, who it's for. So there you go. Like I say, it is laborious, but it is it makes my life so much easier because then I, rem I know what's got to be done and when it's got to be done because I'm so forgetful otherwise. And that's pretty much it. I gave you a quick flick through, but I did it too fast and then it knocked me out. <laughs> and then I realised on the square tracker that I hadn't done the um, any washi tape on it. So I quickly added some to that. And uh, yeah, then I went to flick through and before I knew it, 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 it cut me off right at the end. 
before it goes into my end screen so anyway have a merry christmas and a happy new year um if you don't celebrate that happy holidays whatever you do celebrate i hope it's a good one and that you have a fantastic time i will hopefully be back with a live on this coming sunday and uh, i hope to see you then take it easy guys have a fantastic one bye bye